Welcome back to Virginia This Morning. This Partners in Healthcare segment is sponsored by The Hermitage. In business for over 60 years, generations of families enjoy living at the Hermitage. Gail Knox and Susan Cantrell join us this morning to tell us all about the history of this wonderful, wonderful place in Richmond. Thanks for joining us, ladies. Thank you. Give me uh, the background on what exactly is the Hermitage? The Hermitage is a continuing care retirement community located just outside of Ginter Park on seven beautiful acres, which is unusual in the city. Definitely. And a continuing care retirement community is all levels of care housed under one roof. So at the Hermitage, we have independent living, folks that are retired and looking to give up mowing the lawn, <laughs> shoveling the snow. All the troubles of day to day, exactly. right? Exactly, can come to us where they'll receive all of their meals, housekeeping, mm -hmm. and laundry in some instances and retire with us. All the easy living amenities. Yes. And it's a, you, you mentioned the seven acres and it's in a beautiful old historic home. It is. Mm -hmm. It is. And that's a very unusual thing as well. Yes. Yes. The house was built in 1911 and originally it was called Nonchalance and it was built by um, Jonathan Bryan for his wife Winifred. Now, Winifred did not care for the house, which is really hard to believe because it's a beautiful <laughs> mansion. And, and has, quite the wedding gift. Yeah, and quite the <laughs> wedding gift, and then, he, you know, she didn't like it. Uh -huh. But um, it's, it's just a beautiful home with a beautiful parlor and a large staircase and beautiful woodwork, <coughs> excuse me, and fireplaces. And, um, but they only lived there three years, and then they sold it to another woman. And then in 1948, Virginia United Methodist Homes bought it, and that's when it was turned into a home for senior citizens. And, we're and wings were added onto it. And we're seeing a couple pictures right now that show that beautiful parlor mm -hmm. and, and the living room and the dining room and porch area. Mm -hmm. And it's really unique in that some of the apartments that you have all have their own kind of unique charm. Right, right. We did a lot of, um, over the years, we've renovated the building. And we've made, and so it's not a cookie cutter look to it. So each apartment, you know, some are one bedroom, some are two bedrooms, some are studios, but we were able to uh, renovate so each is unique and has their own uh, characteristics. So when people are, are looking, they can, um, they have lots of options to choose from. And, and one of the points that you mentioned earlier, Gail, the continuing care retirement community, I asked the difference between that and assisted living, but it's kind of encompasses more than just assisted living. Right. It includes assisted living. Okay. So we have our independent living and then assisted living for folks that need a little more help. And it is different in a way from freestanding assisted livings because we provide all of the services that a freestanding assisted living would provide, but we also have nurses there 24 hours a day, seven days a week because as well as assisted living and independent living, we have a licensed nursing facility on property which we call the VIA Healthcare Center. And in that center, we have 72 licensed beds, mm -hmm. some semi-private, some private rooms, and we provide 24-hour nursing care. And you guys will be celebrating uh, the 100-year anniversary of the home yes. next year. Yes. And a couple big plans in store as well as you move into the future. Right. Well, um, a little bit about that specialized care. We are adding in the next few months, mm -hmm. early 2010, a special care center for individuals that have memory impairment or early dementia. Okay. And this will be licensed under assisted living. At this time, we do have a licensed facility for more um, severe cases in part of our nursing home. But what we haven't had and we are going to have in the next few months is a special care center for those with early signs of memory loss. Well, great, well thank you for sharing. Let's let people know how to get in touch with you ladies. Visit the Hermitage, one of our partners in healthcare online, hermitage-vumh.com, or stop by 1600 Westwood Avenue in Richmond, or you can give them a call, 474-1800. Greg and Cheryl, looks like a beautiful place to call home.